Waterways is our flagship program in the environmental education program, and that's just one component of source protection. And we offer waterways to schools in our service area as well as the Tobago Lake watershed. We reach seven schools throughout the service area and the watershed, and that amounts to about a thousand students a year. Waterways is an invaluable part of our water unit. Um, it focuses on the ways we use and protect our water, as well as ways that we can um, avoid polluting it. Many of our students uh, live in and around the water. They're really engaged because what we're learning matters to them and they can take it and apply it in really practical ways. Portland Water District supports environmental education because the students that I work with can take these source protection messages home and share them with their family members. Um, so then, you know, folks who drink the water, they know how their water is protected and what threatens it. And the people who live in the watershed know how they can positively influence Sebago Lake's water quality. And it's a really exciting time to get them excited about science um, because that interest, both in the environment, taking care of the environment, and science will make them really lifelong learners and wanting to explore and understand how science works and how they can make the environment a better place. So it's really a critical age to get them interested in these sorts of things. So do you think it's in our best interest to make sure that we still have habitats that brook trout can live in? The students I work with today, in the future, they may own land in the Sebago Lake watershed, or they may be in our service area and drink the water, so overall they'll know how Sebago Lake's protected and what they can do to make a difference. <laughs>